Hi, welcome to another edition of Sherry's Single Life Adventures. I'm going to attempt to fix my water line in my refrigerator. I got new flooring and when the people installed my floor, my um, ice dispenser and water thing wasn't working in my refrigerator. So I changed the filter because I couldn't even remember last time I changed it and thought that might be the problem, but that was not the problem. So went on YouTube and found out like how to disconnect everything. And what I learned is there was a hole in my water line hose. I'm gonna try to see if I can get back in here. Um, so I think, so I went behind the fridge and got, um, we saw the hole in the hose and of course, I tried to fix it before instead of replacing it. And I had plumbers tape and duct tape because duct tape fixes everything. However, it was not keeping that water tight. And then I realized that I had enough extra tubing. I pulled it up from the from like the garage. And so then I was I just cut off the piece that had the hole in it and that's what I um and I was able to stretch it okay so now I'm down in my basement where all my water lines are and this is really nice like everything is labeled very nicely so I know that this one right here is the um for the ice maker however so there's like this little key that you use to turn like that you could turn the water off and on like the valve so when I was testing, when I was found out that I had the leak, of course, I'm like running up and down the steps. I have a bucket in the hose, but I turn it on and the little key, I hear it drop and it dropped out of my sump pump. So it's gone. So I'm using tweezers because that's what I have on hand. Okay. So I followed the water line to this valve here in my garage. So I'm going to open this up and then I'm going to run... <laughs> Which way does it turn? That's right. Now I gotta. Now I gotta run. I gotta run upstairs. <laughs> run, 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 run. <laughs> run upstairs to see. I turn the valve off up here, but I just. I don't know. So okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So no. There's no water. Okay. So. Oh yeah, and I did unplug the refrigerator. That's like step number one. All right, so now I'm gonna open this valve. Oh, oh, come on. Put that in the bucket. Okay, so I got water. Sweet. So turn that valve off. Okay. So now I just need to connect this right here and then push everything back into the little cubby hole cabinet. Okay, so I just got that on there and I'm going to open up the water valve and make sure that nothing is leaking. So yeah, the water valve is open. Okay, don't see any water. Okay, so now I'm going to plug in the fridge and then push it back in the cubby and then check the water dispenser to make sure it's working. So push me okay. Moment of truth. So I got the fridge back in the little cubby hole. Okay, so let me switch it to water. Oh boy. Oh no. Wait, is it coming? Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. There's probably, I'm guessing there was air in the line. Um, so I'm just gonna hold it here for a while. I hear trickling. Okay, there we go. We got we got stream going. Come on, come on. And then of course my ice maker wasn't working either, so that was really the main thing because um, I like having ice. So I'm just gonna let this run through here for a while. But no, I think I fixed it. <laughs> like. YouTube, you can find out how to do anything on YouTube. It's like the best thing ever. Thanks for tuning in to another edition of Sherry's Single Life Adventures. See, you can do things on your own when you're single, just with YouTube. Until next time.